Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. It's great to have you with me once again. If we've not met before, my name is Katie and it's great to have you along. I have an unboxing today from Shop Disney and it is a Sleeping Beauty 40th, 50th, 60th, 65th anniversary pin. Let's get started. So I have opened the top. Let's have a look at this pin. I'm very excited about this. So let's see what it is like. Okay, it is well packaged. It had all the normal parceling around it. Right, let me just figure this out. There's quite a lot of tape on it. I have my trusty scissors handy. So there we go, one. There's about three bits of tape on here and it's not that big. Uh, there we go. I was looking at the blind pins when they came out and I didn't end up getting any. I got this one instead. There we go. All good. This is the Aurora and Prince Philip pin. And it has got three thousand. This is more difficult to get through than all those thorns. I think that's the last of it. Yeah, there we go, there we go. Okay, so, actually it's folded over again here, but I think we can get in, there we go. Oh my goodness. I didn't know it was gonna take me this long. I've done this bit before I started recording. Here we go, there we go, it's free. Okay, so uh, it says limited edition on the side and the box is green, so let's have a look at this. That is upside down. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> so this is a limited edition of two and a half thousand. And oh, oh look. Oh, how pretty is that? Okay, let's have a proper look at this. So Oh, that's really pretty. Okay, so the detail on the box that's got like the Sleeping Beauty and everything, that is holographic. Um, see if I can get in through the tape. On the front of the box it says, Sleeping Beauty 65th Anniversary, Disney Pins Limited Edition. And as you can see, there's this lovely green box with the trees printed and actually that printing continues at the back of the pins as well and let's have a look so one of 2500 there they are that's pretty let's have a look tip it because i don't want to damage the box so hang on. it's coming it's coming Ooh, we've got pin on pin detail here. Lots of pin on pin detail. Ah, here we go, here we go. Okay. Oh, look how cute that is. Oh, that's really lovely. So you've got two pin backs per pin and it's uh, Philip as he kind of meets Aurora and the green is really pretty. It's that really kind of, it's it's not sparkly, it's it's not pearlescent, but it is really metallic, it's really lovely. Right, let's have a look at Philip first. Oh my goodness. <laughs> there we go, okay, so, come here please, Philip. Good job. So, Philip is riding Samson, it is Samson, isn't it, I think his horse and you've got the mickey heads on the back of the pin and you've got do we have the crystal detail that we had on one of those pins before um oh yeah i see yeah we've got the little the little crystal mickey head on the back of the pin and it says uh, limited edition two and a half thousand you don't seem to get a number from what i can see 
and it says Disney Sleeping Beauty Authentic 2024 Disney Pins. How gorgeous is this? Ooh, really lovely. So this is really beautiful and um, you can see he's got two layers of pin on pin. So um, Samson and the background is one and then he is that second layer on top uh, of himself so that he's slightly 3D. That's beautiful. That's really, really gorgeous. This is a more expensive pin set um, for the two I think is about, hang on, let me check the back. I think it was 45. Um, I did manage to get it with a discount code, so I paid a bit less than that, which is good. Um, so yeah, it is on the more expensive side of pins, but then I have collected fantasy pins in the past and those things can really add up. So um, in the grand scheme of things, yes, it's quite expensive, but um, yeah, it's limited edition and it's Disney, what are you going to do? And it's the anniversary, so <laughs> it's not really surprising, is it? Here we go. In Disney, there's no such thing as cost of living crisis. <laughs> okay, so Sleeping Beauty on the back of her. So again, we've got the little crystal Mickey head. Uh, again, it says Sleeping Beauty 65th anniversary. Again, no number on the back for this particular one. And again, she is, um, oh, oh, she's so pretty. Again, this is two layers. So with her, you've got the tree and the background that she's sat on, which are a single layer. And then she and the rabbits who don't, uh, and the little chipmunk, oh, and the little chipmunks, they are also 3D on top. So again, two pins. Oh, that's really pretty. Really pretty. Beautiful. Oh, they're lovely. And, and so they interact. So he is looking at her as she sits and uh, and she's kind of looking up at him so they do interact really nicely i think these would be nice in a shadow box um with the interaction between them they are really nice in the box that they came in so that's another option and i guess you could put the box they came in in a shadow box as well um but they are really lovely and um they have gold on the back as well i don't think i said that there you go gold on the back <laughs> Don't know why I'm holding them like that. that, that is really weird. Um, but yeah, they are really, really lovely pins. They are expensive uh, for compared to other Disney pins that are open edition. Um, but as I say, they are really nicely made. They're heavy too, actually, especially Philip. Um, quite chunky pins. In fact, if you look at them size-wise, uh, he's probably a bit bigger than a Disneyland Paris pin and she's probably about twice the size of a Walt Disney World pin so they are considerably bigger I guess than a lot of others um, yeah so if I just put them back on the backing quickly well you've seen them on the backing haven't you I'll hold them up against the backing and then you can get a sense again how pretty are those I do like the the kind of shiny bright shiny grass that's really lovely and um, yeah they have been well done there's no like glaring features where you look at it and go oh that's a bit off um no they're really nicely done actually i do like the weightiness of them as well so let me know if you picked these up or if you picked up any of like the blind pins for the anniversary or any of the other sleeping beauty 65th anniversary as you know i got the doll which is oh gorgeous um maybe i could put these with it actually um on display so i hope you enjoyed seeing them thanks so much for joining me and as always until next time take care and bye for now